Hey everybody, this is Dr. Michael Shearer with Fast Track Dental CE. In this video, let's go ahead and take a look at adjacent tooth implant crown contours, and especially those in between adjacent implant crowns, and making sure that we get those crown contours just right with our tie bases and our dental software. Let's go ahead and take a look at this case, which is two adjacent implants at the number 29 and 30 positions. Removing our tie bases from their packages, we're going to go ahead and take the crowns, which in this particular case are straight out of the mill. I haven't done any adjustments to them just yet. To go ahead and facilitate inter-implant contours, I went ahead and used what's called the plane tool, which is a special feature in many dental system softwares, but this particular example is three shape. It allows me to go ahead and create an extremely long contour between adjacent implant crowns. In this particular patient, we do have adjacent teeth with a little bit of recession on each side, which I anticipate some of that tissue to fill in in the future. However, the plain tool gives us really pretty optimal results interproximally between adjacent implants. Make sure you visit FastTrackDentalCE.com for further articles on similar topics.